So hi guys, welcome back to another video on AJ5. So as you can tell by the title and what you're seeing on screen right now, we're going to be reviewing this True God Two God HD dash cam camera. There's a mirror one. Uh, I've done a previous video on this on how uh, on an installation and review. I'll leave a link to that in the description box down below if you want to know how to install it. But I'm going to be doing another installation on a Mercedes A Class. So yeah, keep watching or keep supporting this channel to see that video is coming real soon in the next few days so yeah uh this is the yeah two god two god i don't know how you say it dash cam is the mirror one so i'm just gonna get out the box obviously i'm working with one hand so it can be quite tough So that's the just the empty box. Leave that there. Open this. Which way is it? All right. This way. Let's open it. You've got a little white cover top, and here it is. The dash cam itself. Uh, obviously, I've this is my second time opening. I've got uh, had a one before as well. So well, let's put that to the side and see what else they've got. Okay, here are all the wiring. So this is the little rubber bit that goes onto the mirror. I've always been looking for this. I lost my old one. This is a very helpful tool. I'll show you guys what this little blue thing does. It's very helpful, not just for fitting dash cams, but any wiring work that you have or need to do on your car. Make sure to keep this safe. I'll show you guys in my next video how to use this and why it's so helpful. So I leave that on the side. You've got your cigarette lighter thing for the dash cam, but but yeah, I'm probably gonna change it to a USB version, like I did in my old car. Um, well, let's have a look. So yeah, this is just an unboxing video. You got that. What's this? You've got. Where's this? This is a charging. Yeah, this is actually actually. What is this? I'm not sure if, if this is for the rear. I know there's two. Okay, this might be for the for the rear. No, no, no. This this is the exact same thing as this, but the USB version. So we've got a USB version and a cigarette lighter. But obviously the USB version, the wire is not long enough. You can have probably have to order another one. And this is your rear camera. So you've got the input there, and then you've got your rear camera here. So that is the rear camera, and you've got the black wire to wire it so that you know you have enough wire to take it all the way back to your car obviously this is only this will only work if you you have a normal car like if you have a big 4x4 or a range rover or you know one of them state cars then this won't work you're gonna probably have a, need an extension depending on how big your car is and then the white sorry the red wire that you can see connects to your reverse light so when when um, you put your gear into reverse, the dash cam will automatically show the rear reverse camera. So yeah, I'll show you guys how to do all of that in my next video on how to, you know, install a dash cam. But yeah, these are all the wiring works. You've got your little um, sticky pad thing for the rear camera or to, you know, fix your wires, as you can see here. You focus that. You can see that your wire goes into there, but I don't really use these things, these little things. I just, you know, put it under my roof lining at the top. And then this is to attach at the back of your dash cam. So let's take the dash cam out and see. I'll leave a link to this dash cam in the description box down below where I got it from. It's a very good dash cam. This is my third one, actually. I had it on my two previous cars as well. And yeah, I'm not gonna take it out, but yeah, you've got because you can see everything. But yeah, you can see um, that there's a sticker there. You've got your control buttons at the bottom here. Let me show you guys the back. You've got the camera here. You've got a little sticker there. You can see the tow guard, two guard, five volts DC. And yeah. This is basically the camera and then you can see thank you for choosing blah 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 you can obviously you can take that off you've got your control buttons here at the bottom so you've got your um whatever it's called up down power on power off 
and then you've got your SD card right here and then you've got your reverse camera input here and then you've got your power input there uh, SD card here I've ordered I just ordered a 64 gigabyte micro SD card uh, should be coming very soon but yeah that's pretty much it for today's video just an unboxing video of uh, this tow guard mirror dash cam but yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video leave a like to it and also keep watching subscribe to my channel a video on installation on installing this um, dash cam is coming very very soon i've also made another one or a previous one about a year ago installing it on a Volkswagen Golf Mark 5 so if you want that go check out the description box down below I'll leave a link to that as well but yeah guys that's pretty much it for today's video hope you enjoyed it hope you got something out of this video and yeah please like comment and share with your friends and families who may be looking for a dash dash cam I are cheap as well they're not that expensive normally if you go to uh you know a garage it costs you about 100 150 pounds these are only 30 pounds you can install it yourself I've done it myself very cheap you get a front and rear camera as well totally worth the value i've been using it for about more than a year and a half nearly two years i have no issues so yeah i highly recommend this product here and yeah that's it for today's video hope you enjoyed it and as i said please subscribe to my channel let's try and hit 3000 subscribers and yeah guys i'll catch you guys in my next video